Okay, y'all, little quick news of the day, which I thought was already done. Y'all know I don't really follow football like that. And also, excuse this lighting. I don't know what in the fuck is going on. Like, my light bulbs are dying. <laughs> I finally get the mood to darn going put on some face for once. And it's like both my darn gone lights are dying. This one ain't doing. I swear I'm going to finally get some time to get to that darn going um, ring light this week. But this darn gone sorry ass uncle of mine is coming over here to siphon my damn internet. Like, I, I, this is why I got to get the fuck away from these bitches. I mean, like, are you fucking kidding me? It's bad enough I don't have the weekends to myself. Bad enough I got to wake up and see an ugly ass grizzly bear in the morning. But now you coming over here to siphon my motherfucking internet. I, I, I'm so sick of these darn gone bitches, honey. I, I'm so damn sick of these bitches. I, I got to get the fuck away from that ass. But y'all keep up with the darn gone drama of Diva Wands. Like I keep y'all updated on that front. But yeah, that, that, that just threw my whole damn day off, honey. Ugh. And then, like I said, this is my last work week as well. I only got to do like two hours a day and I'm going to do two more hours and that's it. I, I was going to pull a whole at least seven hour shift a day. And once again, the flexibility of this job that I get to do it, you know, on and off as I like. Ooh, don't get no better than that, honey. Ooh, I got to get back to this schedule with this schoolhouse in the next couple of weeks, which I got to meet tomorrow. I got to download this Zoom on this starring on phone. But... Washington Redskins. That's what y'all here for. I thought they already changed their name. Apparently that they didn't. I, I remember we had this conversation way back in 2016 about the insensitivity that the Redskins and the origin of the name comes from. Just because it's not outright insultive or derogatory doesn't mean that it doesn't have racial undertones like the Aunt Mammy Pancakes, the Uncle Ben's Rice, etc. And just because you are complicit with it doesn't mean that it's okay. Once again, just because you're complicit doesn't make the shit un okay because the origins was derived from racial sentiments of, you know, stereotyping Native American folks. So, they, they finally saying they're going to change it for the upteen time. And this is coming from the uh, the person who said he wasn't going to change. But I guess, you know, in the wake of this climate, he's finally done singing a different tune. So what are y'all thoughts now that they are finally changing the name? Now, I thought it was supposed to be called the Washington Bravehearts. But obviously, they they didn't decide to go with that name. So what y'all thoughts that they're going to name it, honey? Matter of fact, uh, I got one of y'all that's from Washington, honey. Shout out to you, um... I just seen your comment on my um house video. Uh, oh, Lord, child. <laughs> Ooh, child. Mm -mm -mm. See, that's why I can't be up there in Washington. You talking about the house will be two million. Two million. Oh, God, honey. Mm -mm. This country bama bitch will stay right here in North Kakalaki. Two million dollars for that? Now, good. Now, the house is good, but not no $2 million. Honey, $2 million down in North Carolina can get you a motherfucking palace, bitch. Hell, I'm, uh, my next darn on house video, my dream house um video, because I ain't done one of those in a minute. Honey, I can show you what you can get for $500,000 in North Carolina. Five, six, seven hundred thousand dollars you can have a good darn on mini mansion here as well. But $2 million? Oh, child, you talking about... 10 bedrooms, 8 baths, uh, 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 3 acres of land, a 5 car garage. Honey, you th that's what you get for about two, uh, 2 million here. You get about 2, 3 acres of land, a uh, uh, 10 bedroom, 9 bathroom house with a 5 car garage. That's the type of shit that you can get for like 2 million in here. Oh no, God, honey. I wish like hell I would pay t uh, two million dollars for a regular darn gone. Oh no, God. I mean, unless I was darn gone rich like that. Maybe, maybe. Maybe. And you might can get uh, a girl to buy the house up north. Lady. You know, depending on the area. But mm, no, God, honey. But once again, what's y'all thoughts on the Washington Redskins? And there goes my notification now. I'm already doing a video. Me, like I said, I'm in different of the situation, but once again, I, I, I definitely am here for the change. Once again, we can't just settle on complacency, in my opinion, but 
my thing is this, honestly. And the reason why I really don't care is because I don't care for the whole institution of the NFL. We know the NFL, the whole structure of it is built on some racism, honey. They don't let none of the football players who are skilled in the game uh, become coaches. All the damn coaches are darn gone white. Not one darn gone minority that is black that's played the game. I ain't talking about no uh, Middle Eastern, no Hispanic, no Pakistanian. I'm talking about an actual black person that's actually played the game. I have not seen no coach uh, that, that has been a football player. But they darn going to reap it all the damn rewards. So that's problematic within itself. And then the fact that the owners, I mean the football players don't have more control over their image and stuff like that at times. It's like that's another thing. So it's like, with me, I, I I say throw the whole league away, but for y'all that still want to entertain it, what, what, what's y'all thoughts on the Washington Redskins changing their name? Y'all leave it down below, and I'll see y'all soon with more videos. Mwah.